Oh, Ooh. look who showed up. Yeah. We got Rye Guy. It's Riding Friday. the Shermax. Oh, yeah. We're going to have to do a little Shermax review video sometime soon here. Yeah, we are. Range for days. Woo! And Nicholas. Stop it, Nick. Not that Stop it. Stop it. Alright, so I don't know what we're doing today. These guys want to go down to Bristol or some shit? I don't care. We're just riding fast. That's all I know. Eagle horseshoe crabs. That's crazy. That little one is banging the big one. I've seen this before. Alright, what's going on guys? Today on Go George Go, we're going to be doing a high speed range test of the EX20S electric unicycle by Bagode. So far, my lower speed range tests, I've been getting somewhere around 70 to 80 miles on the EX20S, which has been really great. But today, we're gonna try and keep it up above 30 for pretty much the whole ride and see what kind of distance we get. We'll take it down to about 30% battery because after that, you really shouldn't be riding all that hard. All right, so we are starting the test at approximately 100.2 volts. So there it is. You know what, 0.6 volts difference between an actual full, full test, but that won't make much of a difference, honestly. You lose that 0.6 volts so fast. So here we go. Start her up. And of course, I immediately hit some construction traffic and I'm slowed down to a crawl. Always first stop when doing one of these range tests, the coffee shop. All right, so we are at 89% battery after 9.3 miles. I'm trying to keep the speed up. I did hit some detours and I had to slow down for a cop at one point just in case. But uh, yeah, chugging along. Take the coffee. All right, so I putted on over here to the Rhode Island uh, pedestrian bridge with my coffee further lowering my average top speed and undermining the results of my range test but if i don't have my coffee you won't get any range tests so it's what it is right i think i'm waiting for nicholas he said he's gonna come out here and join me so we'll keep uh we'll keep pushing it Woo. oh look who showed up <sighs> yeah. we got rye guy it's Riding. friday the Shermax! Oh yeah. We're gonna have to do a little Shermax review video sometime soon here. Yeah, we are. Range for days. All right, so I don't know what we're doing today. These guys wanna go down to Bristol or some shit? I don't care, we're just riding fast, that's all I know. Oh, look who else oh, just showed up in the wild. I think the long range uh, speed test is done though, cause uh, Mr. Bry guy. Oh, look, he does have the extra battery. You hooked it up? Oh baby, what kind of what kind of battery you got in this thing now? I'm not telling you. He's not gonna tell me. Uh, combined together, 31 amp hour. Oh, maybe we can test range today. We gotta go by his place later, anyway. Get the butt converter. Get the new butt converter. Yeah, for those of you who've been following along on my 12 volt mod, I blew a fuse, so. It was on about a 45 minute to an hour long ride, the headlight blew it. So I'm thinking I either need a smaller headlight or a bigger butt converter. We're going to try the bigger butt converter first because I love this headlight. And the butt converter is cheaper. And the butt converter is cheaper. <laughs> so Nick, you got battery mixers? What the hell is a battery mixer? Did you just rip ass? Yeah. Disgusting. Right here, that's the battery mixer. This is a battery mixer, huh? You plug in two batteries. You plug in two batteries, that and it's got one connection coming out, 
and they can be at different voltages and it'll choose the higher voltage until they match up voltages and then they'll send the same voltage out if that makes sense kind of yeah but so like so it's, so it's basically, basically what one. he's telling you is say if he's got a 72 volt battery and a 60 volt battery he can plug both of those batteries in together at the same time into that mixer and it'll run off the 72 volt battery until the 72 volt battery meets the voltage of the fully charged 60 volt battery and they'll run together once the bms and the 72 volt battery cuts out and stops the battery it'll run strictly off the 60. now brian you're getting a battery mixer as well i am getting a battery Whoa! mixer as well for the trike or for the scooter i have one for the trike already oh and i'm getting one that's coming tomorrow for the scooter badass what that's interesting that? this ride today is brought to you by Fakari sweat the number one sports drink in all of asia Fakari sweat it's got electrolytes, what the body craves. Made with real human sweat. Japanese human sweat. I lived on this shit in Japan. Got a case on Amazon. Where'd you live in Japan? I lived on it when I was in Japan for 12 days. Ah. But you know, I basically have dual citizenship. Ryan's like one of those people that goes to Europe and then like comes back, oh, in Amsterdam they have this. Only you know, in my time in Europe. <laughs> Yeah, he's only he's like, well, in Japan. How long are you there? It Two and a half days. It took me four months to kick my accent. <laughs> I think 25 miles an hour is the legal limit for an e-bike. So if we keep them at 25 around cops, we'll be good. Just don't go 50. Challenged the boys to a race over here so we could try and keep the uh, range test alive for a little while longer. They just say I won. This water is gorgeous today. Look at this. This is unbelievable. I, I can't remember seeing, especially not as it's starting to get warmer, seeing the water this clear. This is amazing. Look how clear the water is, boys. Stats update. I don't know if you can see it. It's Nick as bright as my ugly. phone gets. Nick is still ugly. Ryan's got that right. You stat nerds that want the real goods. Oh, we're going the wrong way. Here we go. Oh, yeah, that was the goods right there. Yeah, PWM chart. Wild Nicholas in his natural habitat consuming one marijuana. 
on average, a Nicholas in the wild needs to consume approximately nine marijuanas a day to sustain himself. True. It's a beautiful day, George. Beautiful day. Can't beat this, can you? This is why we ride. It's pretty tough. This is some fucking beautiful, beautiful water. Oh, All right, bud. Crabs. I'll talk to you after. Right, Are they mating? Big old horseshoe crabs. That's crazy. I'm telling you, that little one is banging the big one. I've seen this before. went hard to get over here. Let's see how far behind the boys are. I just, I just went ham and cheese right there. Let's take a look at some st stats. Oh yeah, we raised our average speed up a bit there. Can you see this? Half battery at 30 miles. We're fucking cruising. This is badass. I'm getting great range, even at higher speeds. Hey, looks like Nick caught up to me. Woo! Stop for some Chinese food. Beautiful. That's me. You don't have to answer if you don't want. Just let Nick and Ryan know. Me and Brian hey. meet, beat Nick and Ryan. George and I are at Prospect Park. Overlooking the city, eating some Chinese. All right. We're here. We got one of the benches in the shade. All right. This is where we all part ways. Nick. Later, bud. Catch you in the next one. traffic here but uh yeah the, the range test has gone really good i've definitely gotten at least as far as i thought i would if not a little bit further but i have to work tonight so it's time to head home guys that's gonna end today's range test we're now at a low enough battery percentage where I really don't feel like riding it much harder anymore that was some good aggressive riding today um, there was definitely a few spots where I had to slow down at different times so I brought my average speed down a little bit but realistically I was pushing it hard today uh, let's take a look at our final stats here let me let me brighten it up for you so you can actually see it hopefully you can see this Yeah, so we went 45 miles essentially down to 34% or 86 volts rested. It was at 30% when I actually stopped. But yeah, 45 miles of aggressive riding. That's really good. It's really good. Oh, you know, you got to figure if it's down to 30%, I can still squeak another 20 miles out of it if I went slow. But that's all we're going to do for today. So uh, thank you guys as always for watching and until next time. I'd say.